Welcome back to the Summer Rain Channel. Today we're going to make a do-it-yourself wax tart. Um, these are hot lips inspired for Valentine's Day. If you haven't done so already, be sure to hit the subscribe button down below. I post a new video every week. I also post a link to my blog where I give you the full recipe. I go more in depth about all the ingredients, why we use them, all of that jazz. So let's go ahead and make our wax tarts. So what we're going to need to make this is we're going to need soy wax. We're gonna need the colorant for the soy wax. This is optional. If you wanna leave it out, you can. I just like a little bit of extra. Um, you're gonna need your fragrance oil. I'm using Love Spell. I am absolutely addicted to this fragrance oil right now. And you're gonna need a silicone mold. I'm using this one with the lips, but you can use any one that you have at the house. Let's go ahead and make our wax tarts. So when you're just starting out and you have a silicone mold like this, you can tell that it's not very thick and you really wouldn't know how much wax you're gonna need. The easiest way to do it is to go ahead, put this on your scale, fill it with some water and see how much the water weighs. That's normally a pretty good estimation of what you're gonna need for wax. When it comes to color, you're gonna have a block like this or maybe you'll have a thicker one like I've used in previous videos. Um, these are your blocks of color. You don't wanna to toss it in just as a full block. Rather, just cut it up into smaller pieces. You can either shave it or go ahead and chop it up. And this is what you're gonna put into your soy wax. What you don't want to happen is you don't wanna pop this in there and not have it melt all the way. So what you wanna do is make sure you have your soy wax in a heat safe container. Go ahead and add your color. And then we're gonna pop this on a double boiler. So I just pulled this off the double boiler. As you can see, the wax is completely melted. What I'm gonna do is go ahead and add the fragrance oil. And then go ahead, give this a good stir. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and pour the melted wax into our molds. And then we'll just leave this to cool completely before we unmold the wax tarts. After you let your wax tarts harden, what you're gonna do is just go ahead and remove them from the mold. To use, just pop them in the wax melter and enjoy.